Minus Girls basketball coach Dave Donarski here. The Blue Wolves are back on the court after winning a state championship last year. Uh, first, just tell us what it's like to be back out here. You've probably been anticipating this day for a while. I have, yeah, and so have the kids. Like, they're excited to get rolling, and uh, we've got a lot of things that we want to try to accomplish this year, as we did last year. So, looking forward to kind of getting it going and starting off with. Uh, with our young kids and, and kind of teaching them what our culture is all about and then kind of moving it forward from there. Right, you mentioned the word young. You lost a lot of seniors from last year's team. Tell us a little bit about the differences from, from last year's team to this year's team as far as you know them now. Yeah, you know, the, the, the question marks, and we talked about this right before we started this, you know, th those kids that we lost were a really, really competitive group and, uh, and they really got after it defensively and really we don't want that to change culturally so we've got maybe some question marks as to how we're going to respond with that. I love the nucleus that we have back truthfully and those kids play a lot of basketball and we had a really nice summer with, with many of those kids having a ton of success so we're really just planning on that kind of moving us forward and, and, and going from there. Aquinas junior Alexi Donarski here getting ready for another Aquinas basketball season after winning state last year. Tell us what it's like to, to transition from volleyball to basketball and get back on the basketball court. Um, it's a lot of fun. Basketball is such a fun time of the year. It's nice to get back at it. Okay. Tell us a little bit about this team because it's a little different than last year's. Uh, tell me a little bit about uh, what this team can do and what its strengths are. Yeah, um, we did lose a really great group of seniors, um, but we do have a bunch of uh, varsity experienced girls coming back to play this year. Okay. How do you guys move forward after losing so many seniors? And, and tell me a little bit about how your role will change this year. Yeah, um, we were such a great defensive orientated team last year that we're really going to have to focus on that this year to get it up to par. Abby Weedman, new coach Abby Weedman, just got hired not too long ago. Uh, tell us a little bit about how the transition has gone coming in so late, what's gone smoothly, what's, what's been tough? Yeah, no, it's been really good. Um, the players and parents have all stepped up to help with the transition. Um, with such a short timeline, there's been a lot to do, but we've all made it here to the first day, and we have a great coaching staff. The kids came with a lot of energy today, and it's been awesome. Okay, tell us a little bit about the team you're going to be putting on the floor this year, now that you're getting to know them a little yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> so uh, we have a solid group coming back. Um, we have a really good upper class group with some juniors and seniors, um, and they've been great leaders so far, which has been awesome, and I think that's really going to help us as this season goes on.